Hi guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. You already know that I visit the Max Liebermann's villa today and by this time I did it at different times of the year. So I visited this villa in winter, in spring and in summer. It's a really new format for me and I hope you'd like it and let me know in comments if I should do more of it. And I wish you good luck and enjoy it! Hello guys and welcome to my winter video about Liebermann Villa in Berlin. Actually I have been in summer here and nature in summer looks like very beautiful here but today we have January that's why I thought it is also important to look at this villa in winter and yeah. Villa! The Max Liebermann's villa was a summer house of the painter Max Liebermann who lived from 1847 to 1935 and he created the summer retreat for his family away from their main residence in the heart of Berlin, near the Brandenburger Gate. Inside the villa you can find an art museum dedicated to the Liebermann's life and work and you can find there his paintings also from this garden. I'm gonna show you the art museum a little bit later, but a central component of the Liebermann villa is also the historical garden. So guys, Liebermann's garden and his villa was planned by himself and he wanted to have like different geometric shapes in his garden like oval one and square and he did it by himself. So I think it's pretty cool. So as we can see, for example, his middle garden has an oval shape and his first garden has a square shape. So he planned it like this. It was his idea to make this garden like this. You've already seen the garden in winter, but let's look at it in spring slash summer. We can perfectly see the like onesie and yeah. I think his idea was really well and it looks very beautiful. January and today is 28 April and everything is green right now and sunny and it looks completely different than three months ago. I think it's time to go inside to see the paintings of Max Liebermann. And before you see his wonderful paintings, I want to tell you a fun fact that I've seen a painting from this villa and from this garden in the Rosengard collection in Lucerne in Switzerland. I'm actually really shocked right now because this painting was painted by Max Liebermann and I live near, the, near his villa and here it says also it's villa where did he live? So I, I know this place, I have been there. So at the art museum you can mostly find his paintings from his villa and his garden. And as you already got it, he was a pretty famous painter at his time. In the next few seconds I'm gonna give you a short overview about his paintings on the second floor. Max 
Liebermann was a German Jewish painter. And on 30th January 1933 was the day when power was handed over the National Socialists. Like other Jewish artists, Liebermann was persecuted as a Jew and his works were removed from public collections. One last self-portrait was created in 1934.